welcome back. You're here with Booth. This is the Sim Pit, and we're doing another rookie track guide. We're at Laguna Seca this week as we come down through the corkscrew. Like us so. Uh, this track is tricky, but very fun. Has uh, plenty of limits to be abused in the case of uh, gaining a little bit of time here and there towards the end. Thanks for some really good racing. But the only bad thing about it is the temperature, because it is always hot, hot, hot. Get ready for sliding around. But uh, there we go. Don't forget to like, sub, share, and all that good stuff to help support the Sim Pit Bros. We're crossing the line, and here's your track guide. So, we cross the line. There's a wall on the left. Make sure you stay tight on, on it. And then watch for the pylons as we zero, cross the hill. Two. Stay back to the left. There should be three. There we go. Over to the left. White line on the brakes, down third, and then second on the big turn in. Slightly catch this apex, not too hard. Catch all of this apex and gas through and out. Third gear, as early as you should be into it. Don't get into it too early or you'll bog down. Get down on the brakes. Third gear for that apex to stay in on the gas, good to go. On warm tires, in, lift, fourth gear, out. Bam, baby, like a boss, everything's fun. Everything is awesome, everything is cool. Second gear, sorry, second sign, down third gear, in, catch that curb, out wide, make sure you catch this apex so that you don't end up off the track on the right over there. Fourth gear, looking for the two sign on the way up the hill, a little bit of break for the keeping the front end down, keep it in, I was a little bit off the apex, so I was a little bit wide on the exit. The tighter you are in the apex, the better your exit's gonna be. Coming up here, get on the brakes, down third gear, second as we bring it in. Now this is one version of this entry. All right, and then as we come back here one more time through our little kink, we want to go through and show you the second version of this. Now I show you two because the first one I show you is technically the faster, but in a race, you'll get dived on. They'll pass you on the inside. So in the race, stay inside third, second hard on the turn in, lonely tree on the way through and out. If you don't know what the lonely tree is, go back and watch. You'll see the tree in the middle. There's two on each side and one in the middle. Third or fourth through here, depending on traction. Back to the left side, breaking in. I like to get on third as I come on my exit. Looking for the two sign. Just after, get on the brakes, down second gear, bring it in. Red corner, get in and out. Oh, a little too much tire spin. If you get two tires on the green on the outside, you will get an off track and it will invalidate your lap. One minute 43.677. Now I got a 143.6 there, which isn't too bad for this lobby. We have a 49 degree track temp, very, very hot. Um, I believe the race is actually like 40, 46 or something like that. I don't know why it's so hot right now. It's crazy. But you should be able to get yourself down into about the uh, 41 area, 42 area. 41s are like fast, fast. 42s you should be able to do if you push and you practice. Um, for anybody though that's like, you know, new to the track or anything like that, if you can get like 44s, 45s, you're probably doing well. See how much better we pull through there? All right, so now we're gonna jump outside of the car and I'm gonna let you guys see a little bit more technically what we're looking for here. All right, in chase cam now, eyes forward, watching the WeatherTech bridge. Car on the left as we pass the wall, eyes to the top of the hill, watching for the pylons on the left. Bring the car back in, watching for your entrance on the right, breaking before the white line, looking to your apex, late apex, the first apex, full apex on the second, and a quick ease to full throttle using the curb for your exit. Now looking for your entrance, that's your two sign on the left, setting up, looking to apex, that's a full apex, then out wide to the curb, back to the track, now a wide entrance and lift using all of the curb at apex. Vision on your exit. Again, using the curbs back to the right side of the track. Vision is paramount here. Always looking. Entrance, apex, exit. 
Now in here at the two, again spotting the apex, now exit, lots of curb for both, eyes to the top of the hill, looking for the two sign. Now here we can lift or slightly brush the brake, but be sure to balance the car. Lots of apex, but no red sausage. Again, a reminder to keep your vision far down the track. That's the most important tip I can give you for Laguna. There are lots of hills. Eyes at the top of the hill now as we come past the three, staying to the right in at the one second gear through only tree as usual going through to the right now left back to the right you don't have to use all of the track just use enough third gear to fourth gear lots of apex lots of track out again back to the left using all of the track in and third or fourth through usually third is better now we're going to move to this here this is our in-car cam i wanted to go through this and uh, give you an actual look at what we're doing here from the inside. You can also see the inputs on the center. Uh, go ahead and go back if you need to, to watch this a little bit more clearly. And uh, you'll notice we didn't do the last corner uh, in our exterior guide. That was just a, re a recording hiccup. I apologize for that. We will come back and uh, look at it here on the inside of camera as we get through. Uh, so as that said, guys, you guys now have the guide pretty much done and uh, up for the week if uh, again as always you could post in the comments with any suggestions or hints anything like that it would be greatly appreciated uh, don't forget as well to like subscribe and share to help support the simpit what sean and myself do uh, we really appreciate all the support and of course the feedback helps us make better content for you and uh, hopefully with me doing stuff like this we're kind of freeing up some time for sean to keep focused on his reviews uh, now, as we come around the bottom here, again, I just wanted to point out, here is our exit in third, coming up to fourth, and here's our last corner that we missed on the external view. So from the left side of the track, back to the right, just after the two sign, we're going to get on the brakes, aiming for the red curb on the left. You can cut it a bit with this one, and watch your inside tires on your exit. Don't let them touch the green, and you'll be good to go. Thanks again, as always. This has been the Simpit Rookie Guide, and we will see you guys again next week.